Today, Jokic and Embiid will start at a 40 overall and race to see who can hit 99 overall first. At the beginning of each year, they'll compete in a challenge to help them go from 40 to 99 overall. And the winner of the challenge will spin from the guru that gives you a 60% chance of a good upgrade, a 30% chance of a mid upgrade, but a 10% chance of a great upgrade. And the loser will spin from the bad will that gives you a 60% chance of a mid upgrade, a 30% chance of a good upgrade, but a 10% chance of a downgrade. The goal of this video is to hit 99 overall and win an NBA championship in that order. Subscribe to the channel to give me more clout and follow my Twitch and Twitter. I stream every day and talk about basketball all the time. Let's go. Today's video is sponsored by Raycon. And I'm here to talk to you guys about Raycon's everyday earbuds. Are you tired of paying too much for a pair of high quality earbuds? Well, so am I. And the Raycon everyday earbuds provide the quality of those pricey earbuds, but at half the price. You can also get two years of product protection insurance for just a few bucks. And they also have a free and easy return guarantee. So I've been able to use the Raycon everyday earbuds for about two months now. So let me go ahead and give you guys my personal experience using them. My main gripes with earbuds in general are two things. The first one is wearing them for too long and them ending up making my ears itchy or start to hurt. And the second one is them constantly falling out. But remember, these are high quality earbuds for half the price. So especially when I'm working out or on the basketball court, I'm not having any of these issues. I can make quick movements on the court all day and not have them fall out. I can go through a long workout and not feel any pain, thanks to the Everyday Earbuds custom gel tips. Or if I'm just using them to relax or go for a walk, I can turn on the awareness mode so I can be aware of my surroundings. And I can also use them for up to eight hours. If you're working out, going through your daily chores, or just relaxing, the Everyday Earbuds will make a great purchase, especially for the price. So click the link in the description or go to buyraycon.com slash YNG to get 50% off your Raycon purchase. Shout out to Raycon for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back into the content. All right, well, let's get into the first challenge here for Jokic and MB. What do we got here at 1v1? Go ahead and start it off. All right, well, here we go. Our first 1v1. Sorry for the raspy voice. It's hard to be a Heat fan right now with us in the finals. MB trying to drive to the basket here. Nothing. Th that's just, that's an amazing shot, but got his own rebound. There you go. All right, good start. Yoke. He's going to get the own rebound, though. Go back out with it. Okay, that might be the only way these guys can score. Jokic driving lay. Oh, that would have been tough, but he got his own board. Got it up and good to go. What's MB got in the bag here? That's ugly, but he got his own board. Put it back up. Okay, we got a tie game. Jokic in the post, spinning off, pump faking. He definitely just traveled right there, but okay, that's fine. Got his own board. Oh, that's a killer, man. This was a very painful game to watch. 3 for 28 and 2 for 20. But even after all that nonsense, Jokic is going to get an upgrade on the goodwill. It's going to be plus down on the defensive attributes. That's a mid-upgrade, but okay, fine. That got him up to a 43. And now let's see if MB can get lucky here on the bad wheel. What do we got? He actually got himself a good upgrade, plus 20 off finishing. Hey, man, luck of the wheel. And that brought him beat up to a 45 overall. Neither one gets playing time, but let's see what happens. Got a shocking MVP here. Philly somehow still pretty good, and Denver's terrible. And neither guy played an NBA minute. I'll show you it once they actually start getting minutes. Sixers lost in the first round. And the Cavs beat the Lakers in seven. What a finals. Jokic is now a 46 and Embiid's up to a 48. Even though Embiid's in the league, you still want to avoid getting the bad wheel as much as possible because you don't want to end up getting a downgrade or a bad upgrade, whatever you got. Now Embiid, they get plus 20 to all of his finishing and he just went right past Jokic. What are you doing? Gotta play better defense than that, Jokic. Oh, that was nasty. Okay. Embiid trying to... Oh my god, like did you get a handle or something? That's nasty. Jokic driving to the basket, big body and MB. What a tough move from Jokic. And Jokic go back to back here. Missed it, got his own board, put it back up, and then Jokic with a huge comeback to win this second game. Let's see if Jokic can actually get a good upgrade this time. What do we got? Okay, finally, plus one to all defensive badges. He's got every defensive badge now up to a 47. And let's see what the bad will have in store for Embiid this time. Okay, a very a mid upgrade plus to end all defensive. And Embiid's taking two bad wheel spins to get himself to a 51. We got a close race here. Let's keep going. Tatum with an MVP. Philly and Denver are both the 11 seed. And Boston went ahead and won it all. Jalen Brown finals MVP. He must have learned to go left anyway. Embiid's a 54. And Jokic is a 50. Even though he won two games, he's got some work to do. So now let's go ahead and see what that next challenge is going to be. Stop DeAndre Ayton. Okay. All right, well, let's see if Embiid can stop DeAndre Ayton here. Ayton, he's going aggressive, bro. What? I mean, that's as good as you can play. <laughs> Which means if Jokic gets this stop here, he's going to win three straight challenges. Ayton working in the post here. What does he got? Banging down low with the hook. Missed it. Rebound Jokic. That's three straight wins for Jokic. It feels like I'm watching the finals right now. Jokic doing everything he can, dropping 40 and still losing. But now, okay, now he's going to get some attributes. That brought Jokic up to a 54 overall. And now let's see if Embiid can avoid a downgrade here. Plus, he got a good upgrade. Of course he, bro. Embiid is getting so lucky. He's now got every playmaking badge up to a 55. Let's see what happens in year three. Luka with another MVP. Denver and Philly are still terrible. The Cavs win it all again. Look at Donovan Mitchell. Embiid's up to a 58. And so is Jokic. So we got a close one. And you would have to think eventually Embiid's luck starts to wear out here. We got another 1v1. It's a 50% chance on this wheel. So we've been getting it a lot. Oh my God. Embiid. Tough move. Embiid driving. Missed it. Oh, oh he made that 100% smothered. Good move by Jokic to get on the board. Oh my. How do you smoke that? Okay, he got his own board. Oh my god! 
Okay, there you go. And Bead finally gets his first win. So let's see what potential good upgrade and Bead's gonna get here. Plus 20 to all finish it. That brought Embiid up to a 65 overall. This video could not be going better for Embiid right now. What's Jokic gonna get here? One lowest rating boost 99. That's really good. And his lowest rating was Excel at a 26. So now, I mean, that's gonna help out a lot in the 1v1. Let's see what happens if Bidi Jokic still aren't playing. Shea with an MVP. Philly's the worst team in the league and Denver's the 12th seed. And the Pistons are your NBA champions. Cade Cunningham, finals MVP. Damn, LeBron played 23 years. And B went up 10 overalls to a 68. And Jokic is at a 63, not far behind. Just gotta find a way to win one of these challenges, even though he's won pretty much all of them. Listen, that's just how life works sometimes. Another 1v1. Jokic getting blocked. Wow, good defense from B. Got his... You're lucky, bro. <laughs> nah, that's crazy. Yoga John to the basket here. Free lap. I don't know what Embiid was doing. And B go to work. Wrap around. That was a pro move. And B looking for the. Hey, 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 hey. Nah, offensive foul, bro. Nah, I'm calling that shit. I'm playing. I'm playing. <laughs> they won. That's crazy, though. Nah, this was crazy, bro. Look at that. <laughs> that's wild. Well, then B got himself another win. Let's see what his upgrade's going to be. Oh, that's a mid upgrade. Plus five finishing badge points. He got some finishing badges and went up one overall. Let's see if Jokic can yet again survive the bad wheel. Plus, of course, Jokic gets a good upgrade and B gets a mid upgrade. He didn't go up any overalls, but at least he's establishing the badges. That's good to do. I expect one of them to get minutes next year. Shea with another MVP. I don't know how Philly's the number one C, but okay. And they lost in the first round anyway, so who cares? The Pistons win it all again. Look at Cade Cunningham going on a run. Jokic made his way to a 67, and then beat that a 73. Wow, Jokic got a lot of work to do. Can we maybe not get another 1v1 here? Okay, stop. Shaq is gonna be insane. Well, Embiid, give it your best shot. Shaq driving here, big body in. Oh! No! Oh, you had a chance! Shaq going to work here, big body in, in the post. Oh my god. Okay, well, now it's side and death. Next one, the first one to get a stop now wins. Shaq going to work here, driving right by Embiid. Good defense, get the board. Okay, Embiid got the stop somehow. I thought this one was going to take forever, bro. Shaq's just too big. Pause, but yeah, okay. It is looking great for Embiid fans right now. What do you got? Plus 20 to all physicals. Embiid is now at 76. And now let's see what's on the board on the bad wheel for Jokic here. Plus, he, he keeps getting these badges. All right, it's not bad. I don't think Jokic went up, but he got a lot of good defensive badges. Jokic has a 67, is now the starting center. And and Embiid still not getting any minutes. Look at Eamon Thompson winning one. Billy's the 17. Denver is okay. They're at the bottom. Jokic had a solid year dropping 12, 5, and 5. He didn't shoot that well, but still. And Embiid actually got minutes this year dropping 13, 3, and 3. Not bad. But we don't care about their playoff runs until one of them hits 99 overall. So this, none of this matters. Embiid has hit 80 overall. And Jokic just barely hit 70, bro. This is bad. Jokic has been very unlucky with the wheel. And he's just been losing recently. Stop Taco Fall. Okay. Well, I feel like this shouldn't be too hard, but maybe I'm wrong. Taco trying to drive here. Okay. Okay, yeah, they're... Oh, oh, you gotta get the rebound and beat... <laughs> oh, okay. Well, Jokic, the opportunity's here right for you. And you let Taco blow right by you, bro. All right, you both suck. Taco working in the post. Post hook. Missed it. Taco going to work here. Sp okay, that's... Yeah, that, that is not in your bag, bro. Jokic gets this win. Jokic needs a prayer here from the goodwill. What do we got here? Plus 20 to all shooting. There you go. Jokic is now a 77 overall with a 99 three-point rating. That is for sure going to be a threat in the 1v1s. What do we got here? Plus five finishing badge points. That's a mid-upgrade. He's still an 80 overall, but he got himself some bronze badges. Embiid's coming off the bench, and so is Jokic. Anthony Black with an MVP. Denver's still terrible, and Philly is the 11th seed. Embiid somehow having a down year compared to last year. That's kind of weird. And so did Jokic, but he was more efficient for sure. Cavs win it all. Brandon Ingram just randomly in Cleveland. Jokic got all the way up to an 80 and Embiid's up to an 84 but we got a much closer race now. This is a big challenge for both Embiid and Jokic. What do we got here? Stop Julius Randle. Well, you just force him right. You'll be fine. Let's see if Embiid follows my advice. Oh, okay. Randle going left. I told you. Randle trying to drive right here. Randle, I guess, beat the allegations there. Now we're back in sudden death. Randle going right. What did I say? I called it and B with the win. Let's see if MB can get his commanding lead back. Plus 20 to all defense. Oh, nice voice crack. That brought him beat up to an 88. And we haven't seen a downgrade. Let's see what uh, Jokic gets here. Plus, we almost got minus five overall. Okay, he dodged a bullet. And that only got him to an 81. And beat is now starting. So is Jokic. I'm surprised Victor took this long. Denver's still bad. And Philly is the sixth seed. And Embiid had a great year, dropping 19, 10, and 3. Not bad at all. And Jokic had himself a pretty good year, shooting 45% from three. The Bulls went ahead and won it all. Gregory Jackson finals. MVP. Jokic made his way to an 85, and Embiid is at a 91. Eight overalls to go. Got another big challenge here for Jokic and Embiid, a 1v1. All right, let's see where we're at. Beating the post, big body with the hook. Got it to go. All right, good shot from Embiid. Let's see if Jokic has a response here. Tough lay from Jokic. Jokic driving here. That's a terrible shot, but he might get his own rebound. Gets his own board and puts it back up and in. 2-1 lead for Jokic. Embiid driving. Nothing there for him. That's great defense, but he got his own board. Puts it back up, and then we got a tie game. Embiid trying to go for the win here. Working in the post. Oh my god, just babies Jokic. 
Embiid. And now Embiid has earned himself a spin on the go. Oh, God. That's... That is nasty. Embiid is now a 95 overall and the best player on his team. This man, Jokic, is looking cooked right now. Plus 20 all finishing. That's really good, but still, you're way behind. I mean, he's only down seven overalls, but it's just, yeah, that max physicals is crazy. Hopefully, Embiid doesn't win a ring too early. He's got to win it when he's a 99. Ja with an MVP. Somehow, Jokic made an NBA team, but Embiid didn't. Philly's the third seed and Denver is the fifth seed. And Jokic had a great year dropping 23, 8, and 7. And Embiid dropped 22, 12, and 4. I don't know how you to make an NBA team. But the Kings are your champions, Victor. Web and Yama getting a ring. Embiid is now at 98 overall, man. These challenges are going to stop next year. So Jokic has to win this next challenge. So let's see what we got for probably the last challenge here of the video. Score on Taco Fall, okay? I feel like this is going to take forever. Embiid driving to the basket here. No way you just got boxed by Taco Fall. Jokic cannot sell this opportunity. Jokic trying to drive to the basket on Taco. You guys suck. Well, now we're here in sudden death. and Embiid driving to the basket. Missed it. Oh, my God. Jokic, big body. And, like, why are y'all trying to big body taco? And B driving here. Oh, my God. Like, if you cannot score on top. Bro. This is crazy. Jokic trying to drive here. It's ugly. Getting deep in the post. Finally, someone scores on Taco Fall. Well, Yoki got a 10% chance here for a great upgrade. Plus 20 all physicals is not a great upgrade, but it'll help. That brought him to a 91. And I guess Embiid has a 10% chance for a downgrade here, but he got a mid one. Plus five defensive badge, boy. And that didn't get him to a 99, but he's going to hit it in the offseason next year. So save that championship for one more year. Looks like it worked out for Atlanta. I'm surprised Philly and Denver are still bad with Jokic and Embiid being good now. Embiid had a solid year. Nothing crazy for being a 98 overall. And Jokic is outplaying Embiid as a lower overall. And the Kings went ahead and won it all. Julian Evans finals MVP. Jokic went up to a 94, and Embiid is officially a 99, so the challenges are done. So now all Embiid has to do is win a championship. And hopefully Jokic can catch up and get to a 99 so we can make this video competitive here at the end. Look at Cade going crazy. Denver's the 2C. Meanwhile, Philly's the 6C. They're not playing that well. And Embiid's dropping 18 points a game, bro. These numbers are getting bad. If Jokic could just get to 99 overall, man, this, this could be tough for Embiid. And Embiid got swept in the first round. 13 points. Bro, he's choking just like in real life. And the Pacers won the championship. They actually beat the Nuggets who made the finals. I'm telling you, if Jokic can get themselves to a 99, man. We're gonna have a video. He only went up one overall. This is rough. B's gotta lock in here. Victor with an MVP. Denver's the one seed and Philly's the fifth seed. And B's gotta get out of Philly, man. These stats just suck. Especially compared to Jokic, bro. 27, 11, and 8. And B's got a game 7 in round 2. And they lost. Of course they did. And the Pacers won the championship, I think, again. And Jokic again made the finals. If he could just hold off and B for three more years, he might have a chance. Steve Lynch with an MVP. Philly's the seventh seed. And B's dropping 20 a game. While Jokic is dropping 26, 12, and 7. And they actually got themselves to the conference finals. Where he's got to play Wemby, but he's at power four for some reason. And they just got swept, so, uh, yeah, tough. And Victor got himself another ring. And Bede re-signed in Philly for five years. Nice, man. And Jokic is still a 96. He is getting better. It's just not gonna really show that much when going to 99. Steve's going crazy. And Philly was the ninth seed and didn't make it out of the play-in. You know, we expect 2K to be unrealistic, but, I mean, I, I guess I can't really hate on it. And Bede just be choking his ass off, so, you know, what are you gonna do? And the Pelicans won it all. Patrick Woolwich is winning a ring. Jokic up to a 97. Steve's going crazy. And finally, Philly's good. And Bede's still barely averaging 20. And Jokic went down a bit here, dropping 24. And he got gentlemen swept by Victor. 17 points a game is crazy. Jokic stayed at a 97, but he's still getting better. Time's running out, Embiid. You gotta make this quick. Victor win an MVP. Philly's still pretty good, but these stats are just not overwhelming. And now Jokic is dropping 24 a game. Embiid's back in the conference finals. I get the Heat team. Oh, this is Steve Lynch's team. And Embiid might be booking his ticket to the finals here. Yes, he is. And he's gotta take down Victor to get this win. Here we go. Game one, Suns take. Game two, Suns take. Game three, Philly takes. Game four, Philly takes. Game five, Suns take. Philly barely wins here in game six with Embiid dropping 34 and 14. Finally not choking. And now we have game seven. And ladies and gentlemen, it's a blowout. Congrats to Embiid for overcoming that 2-0 deficit and finally getting a championship after like five, six years of hitting 99 overall. That was crazy. But he was finally able to break through and win that championship. About damn time. This man had 25 and 24 with four steals and five blocks. What a game. And he was finals MVP dropping 24 and 14. Well, congrats to Embiid on hitting 99 overall and getting a virtual ring. Maybe Jokic gets the real one. Goodbye. As I'm editing this, my team is down 3-1 in the finals right now, so I would really appreciate if you guys just click the video right there in the middle, because it's a video that is recommended to you by YouTube. They actually think you'll like watching it, so to make me happier, to make me feel good, it would mean a lot if you just click that video right there, because I am just in a uh, spiral of despair from my team being bad. So yeah, I would appreciate it a lot. Okay, thank you. All right, all right go ahead and uh, click the video now if you haven't already. I don't know why you're wasting your time. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Bye.